What's up everybody, Damon here with IGN News. A host of leading experts in the field of astrophysics have joined forces to hunt for world-destroying asteroids. According to the Financial Times, the International Group of Astronauts, which is helmed by British Royal Astronomer Lord Rees and is a group I very much wish I were a part of, aims to inform the public that a deadly strike is a worrying possibility. Astronaut Ed Liu says, NASA has done a very good job of finding the very largest objects, the one that would destroy the human race. It's the ones that would destroy a city or hit the economy for a couple of hundred years that are the problem. Academic projects to track down killer asteroids aren't a new thing. In fact, these types of projects have been around for the past 50 years. But they saw an increase in 1998 when NASA was given 10 years to identify near-Earth objects of a specific size capable of leaving the human race extinct. Astrophysicists worked out that rocks as small as 164 feet in diameter would still be big enough to cause unparalleled destruction should one hit Earth. Now Brian May, guitarist for Queen and also astrophysicist, said, The more we learn about asteroid impacts, the clearer it becomes that the human race has been living on borrowed time. The campaign launched this week is intended to raise awareness and put pressure on governments to act. In 2013, a meteor passed undetected through the atmosphere over Russia. Although only being 65 feet in diameter and mostly incinerated before hitting the ground, the shockwave from the blast still injured 1,500 people. For more terrifying space news, stay tuned to IGN.